Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu fired his defense minister Yoav Gallant on Tuesday, citing a crisis of trust in a videoed address to the public released by the Prime Minister's office. Netanyahu appointed Foreign Minister Israel Katz to succeed Gallant as defense minister while Gideon Saar becomes the new foreign minister. Gallant and Netanyahu, both in the right-wing party, have clashed for months over the objectives of Israel's 13-month-old war in Gaza against Palestinian militant group Hamas. There had been open disagreements between the two, reflecting a wider split between Israel's right-wing governing coalition and the military, which has long favoured reaching a deal to end the fighting and bring home scores of hostages held by Hamas. Meanwhile, protesters in Tel Aviv on Tuesday blocked the highways and lit bonfires in the streets in protest after Netanyahu fired the defence minister. Protests broke in different cities like Naharia, Haifa and in Jerusalem, close to Netanyahu's residence. Protesters expressed their dismay, saying that his move endangers the Israeli people and the country. A hostage family member, Zahir Shahar Moore, said, and I quote, Tonight is a spontaneous outburst of rage because we have had enough. He thinks the firing is an act of betrayal by this government to the hostages and the Israelis. Other protesters also said that they feel that the government had failed them after hearing about Gallant.